The overall goal of this procedure is to show the synthesis of the activity-based probe ARN14686 specific for N-acylethanolamine acid amidase, or NAAA, and describe its use for detecting the catalytically active enzyme in cell extracts and tissue sections. This method can help answer questions about the in vivo function of Na, providing insights into Na activation in different physiological and pathological conditions, such as inflammatory and neurodegenerative diseases. Its main advantage is that sample manipulation is subsequent to Na reaction with the probe, thus giving reliable information about the in vivo activation state of the enzyme. Another advantage is that, contrary to specific antibodies, our probe detects only the active form of the enzyme, which is useful for fluorescence microscopy studies. Visual demonstration of this method is critical as it combines different expertise that built up to a complete story from probe synthesis to its final applications. In a 50 milliliter round bottom flask, dissolve 350 milligrams of undecinanol in 3.5 milliliters of dry dichloromethane. Then, add 25 milligrams of DMAP and 530 milligrams of DPC to this solution. Stir the mixture at room temperature for 16 hours. After 16 hours, add 20 milliliters of dichloromethane to the solution. Transfer the mixture into a separating funnel. Add 15 milliliters of water, shake the mixture, and allow the two phases to separate. Next, open the stopcock, collect the